Hey y'all. Hey. We are going to talk about our gift, our RV. Our RV. Uh, the video we promised y'all was coming. This is just crazy. Um, <laughs> it's a crazy blessing to us. Um, I guess you tell how. So a friend of ours, a family friend that I've known for a very, very long time. Um, we went to church together since I was probably 15, but my mom actually knew her when my mom was a teenager because uh, uh, family has always gone to that church. So it's just been one of those things that we've just been connected for a long, long, long time. But anyway, um, she messaged me, her and her husband messaged us and asked us to call and we called and they said that they wanted to give us this RV. They knew what we were doing and we were living in campers, staying in campers right now. and. Um, and so they uh, thought that we could probably use more space, which we can absolutely, absolutely can. <laughs> so um, we were just like, wow. And they said that um, they're not super mechanical people, but they thought that it needed a fuel pump. And, and yes, a and the left front brake, or left front wheel was locking up, which usually is a brake caliper. So uh, we, and they were in Knoxville, yeah. his friends, and that's where the RV was. So. Uh, they sent me the VIN number and I went on the uh, auto parts website, auto parts store website and put in the VIN, ordered a fuel pump and ordered a brake caliper and off to Knoxville we went. So, we had uh, quite the adventure. It was a, yeah. it was a 17 hour day. 17 hour Austin. day, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's only what, like eight and a half hours of driving, maybe nine? No, it's three and a half hours. Total, round trip. So seven so hours. So seven, eight, seven, eight, eight depending hours. Depending on yeah. while stopping for fuel, so about yeah. eight hours. So anyway, um, so the rest of the time we spent working on the RV, Jack and I. Yeah, they had, have a, um, a pool in their backyard, so I watched the kids and the kid, the other kids all swam. So they had a great day. Yeah, they, <laughs> they did. And playing. And, and me and Jack had a good day. Yeah, it went they well. They fed us lunch. And um, we got there. The fuel pump that I had ordered was the wrong one completely. Um, even though the vent and everything matched, it was just the wrong one. So we took the fuel pump, the old one out, the old one out, and went to the auto parts. Went store. to the auto parts store with it. After I think four trips to advance, we finally had the number cross-referenced and the right pump in hand. We got back and put it in. It was a defective fuel pump. <laughs> back to a different auto Sorry. parts store to return that, and because they didn't have one at the same one, you had to go yeah, to a different, to a different one, one again. Down. So uh, we finally got one that worked, got it put on, and it fired right up and ran great. We, um, it, was a brake it had been caliper, sitting for yeah. five years. The brake caliper was locking up on it and sticking, so we pulled that off, put a new one on, bled the brakes. Uh, still need to work on that a little bit. Uh, they're still kind of spongy, but yeah. we're home with it. Um, we got home... Was at it one, one in, the morning? in the morning? Yeah. yeah, I followed in the van. I was like struggling. I'm like, I don't do nighttime driving we're, very well. We're not, we're not, <laughs> we're late, not night out. Night, not, not, I was yeah, like, night oh owls, man, yeah. but we made it. But we and, made it back. Uh, it did great. We did it. It did. Out. And uh, here it is. So, we've got it up top right now. We're going to do some work to it as far as um, just basically just checks to make sure everything works on it and it, and yeah. it should. Um, but before I drive it back down the hill, I'll probably need to bleed the brakes some more. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. Yeah. So. Um, but yeah, and we're really excited because this is great for us right now. It gives us some more space. But we've we don't do a lot of traveling or vacations or anything um, because well we have a farm, so it's hard to leave. But when yeah. we do, we try to do day trips. Like we've gone to see my family. That's five hours away, but we do a one a day trip. We get leave in the morning and see them, and then get come home, which mm -hmm. is really tough to do. You know, when you're talking about ten hours of driving be there for two hours or whatever right but um we just had to get a hotel room for 10 people and then the money you know if we don't take food and to eat out and it's just and it's bad for us so as we've always been like if we could just get an rv um because of the camper we have to take two vehicles you have to pull the truck with the camper and then i have to pull on the van because there's not enough pull seats. the camper with the truck what did I just say? Truck with the camper. Yeah, I would have. Pull the camper with the truck. Y'all know what she truck. means. You know I'm what just I mean. picking at her. like, what is it? Um, yeah, pull the camper with the truck and then I have to follow the van because we don't have enough seats in the truck for everybody. So we've always said if we could just, if we had an RV, then we can take all of our food. We can all sleep in it. We can drive it. It's our vehicle. It's not that much longer than the van that we already drive. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I don't know about that. It really is a lot longer. <laughs> no, but in all seriousness, we it's something that we've always wanted that yeah. we could do more in like the home It's setting. one of the pipe dream things. Um, yeah, the home setting conference, the HOA conference, it's 
uh, well, it's a little bit farther from here, but it was two and a half hours, right? Was it two and a half from 2.15, two hours, 15 minutes? Yeah, something like so that. So we did it, we went both days, but we drove back and forth. Now we have the milk cow too, so that adds to the, but I feel like we have, we can find some new milk cow for us to do an overnight trip yeah. at this point. So now we there have a way to do it. We're excited. It's very exciting. Yeah. So yeah. you want to do the grand tour? Yeah, let's do a grand tour. All right. We'll do the Vanna. All right, this is the door. <laughs> Sorry. And Hang on. And the kids have been all in here, so I didn't realize they've been tromping here yeah, with muddy feet. Yeah, we need to feet. sweep it in. But that's the cool it. thing. Yeah, it's hard the floor they've put laminate, like so we don't have carpet. Laminate so flooring, like, so awesome. way easier to clean. Great yeah. for the kids. So this is a slide, and it's slid out now. And you have the couch with seat belts, and it's a pull-out bed. Mm -hmm. There's an armchair there, um, recliner, you can see that as well. It's the lighting, there we go. Yeah, and then your two big seats, which are very comfortable. It's uh, You said it was really nice to drive. Oh, it, it drives really good, and uh, it rides really good, surprisingly. I, I Well, maybe not. I just It rides better than I expected yeah. it to ride. So you got a really cool old old GPS system here. Well, it's or not, it's, it's, a, a, it's a backup camera. Oh, that's right, it's yes. a backup camera. And there's a microphone, so if somebody's standing behind me, they can tell me, <laughs> keep on coming back, keep on coming back, or whatever. Yeah. I can hear them. Big but, old uh, giant TV. Yep. It only has 25,000 miles on it, which is awesome. Is that a, uh, uh it looks like a VCR or DVD oh, player or something nice. up in there. Yeah. So, but anyway, and then, oh, you come around this way. Yep. And there's no table. They said that they had a table banquette thing in here. Um, and they had pulled out with plants, put a different table in, and then they never did, which is fine. Um, so there's just this big open space. Which we'll probably, we might do some kind of custom built-in bunk bed right yeah, now. Yeah, we might do I that. I have to measure and see how far this couch comes out and see if I can fit yeah, a bunk bed there. Yeah, we might be able to do something. And then, um, and of course, when the slide goes in, it should be. Yeah. Um, and then, of course, the kitchen area. Mm -hmm. The sink, the stove. It has a microwave, which we don't use a microwave. The fridge is over here. The fridge runs on uh, AC, DC, and gas. gas. Yeah. So it works on all three. Yep. And then you come back here and you have a built-in corner cabinet. For I guess it's like for doing your makeup. <laughs> yeah, there's mirrors and towels. Oh, you come on. Yeah. It's going through. And then the bathroom, which is pretty big. And it's all together as one room with the sink and everything. Yep. Which most of them are not. They're... Usually they have a water off. closet or something. Yeah, yeah and so, the sink's separate, so. Decent size shower, and you're right there. I'm backing you're the right. sink. <laughs> I've got to figure out how to make this work. <laughs> back, I'm going this way. Beep, beep, back up. And then, bedroom. here's the master yep. bedroom. So, and then it's got like this closet and cubbies on the side. Storage, so. storage over the bed, yep. storage like right okay, down this table. wall. Lights table on either side, which is really yep. nice, so. With lights on either side. Yeah. So anyway, yeah. and it has a brand new mattress, they said, yes. which is really cool. Yeah. So yeah, this Great. is this is cool. And he rigged it with storage under the bed, the way he's got it set okay, up. Okay, good. Yeah. I didn't realize that, but mm -hmm. yeah. So this is pretty awesome. We're really excited about it. And we got to do a few things and get it moved down the hill so we can utilize it and use it. And I think it'll be, uh, be good. I think Very it's going to be awesome. Great. Yeah. All right, y'all. All right, <laughs> y'all. <laughs> I well, don't know what that was. <laughs> I guess uh, that's the RV tour. Super excited, super blessed, and yeah, uh, just very amazing. thankful um, that that God is blessing us, and, and we have friends and people that are just blessing us. It's just um, it's awesome. It's crazy. I mean, who you know? I don't know. It's just amazing how how God is working, and um, but but yeah, um, I can't wait to get the time to get this thing checked out and hooked up down there and 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 rolling it's going to be yeah. great we're very really cool and exciting about. yeah so. so well we appreciate y'all we're glad you're on this journey with us if you're not already subscribed please go ahead and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss anything and if you hit the notification bell you'll be notified every time we upload a video if you give us a thumbs up it'll let youtube know you're enjoying what you see and please comment below let us know what you think of our new wheels yeah <laughs> our new ride our new ride our new, yes. our new home it's like a turtle a turtle. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I get it. Because the home yeah. is here. Yeah, we, inside. Yeah. I get it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> We're cool, y'all. All right. Um, See y'all later. See y'all later. See ya. <laughs>